Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to be doing a plan with me for the week of Valentine's Day in my Hobonichi cousin. This is the Avec. And if you would be interested to see how I decide to decorate this next week, then go ahead and keep watching. Oh, and I do really quickly, look at my little cute dude. I got him on Amazon, I, it's like a pack of four and you can get like different like faces for him, but he's so cute. I just, I had to, I had to show him off. He, he's, he's now gonna be my, my little companion on these videos, so I love him. But regardless, anyways, okay, back to the actual regularly scheduled programming. So this week, like I said, is Valentine's week and I've decided I'm going to use some Coffee, Wa Coffee Monsters Co. Washi. This is, I have no idea what it's called, but I got it, I think in a subscription kit, maybe. I'm not sure, but it's pink and it's got clouds and it's very, very cute. So we're gonna be using this. And then I also have my Tombow. This is 817. The lid, I think, might've been swapped with a different pink lid because the color that is going to come out of this I don't think it matches this so I don't know I think there was a cap that got me messed up but that's the colors we're going to be using and we're going to go ahead and just flip we're gonna move him a little bit so I have room we are going to flip to the week of 12 February to 18 February and we are going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing I always do is I do sleep, workout, and like a to-do list on my sidebar. And then after that, I lay down my washi at the bottom. And then I start laying down Tombow and highlighting all the different appointments that I have. And that's kind of the order that we're going to go in. So we're going to use 817. And we are going to turn this sideways because that's how I roll. And we're going to go ahead and just highlight the headers for the sleep, workout, and to-dos. So we have this. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, look, I love the color, but it does. I don't think this is the right cap. I really think this cap somehow got swapped when I was doing all of my washi or all of my Tombow swatches. I really think this cap got misplaced for a different Tombow because I just don't think this cap is supposed to be for this color, but I don't know for sure. So, all right, so we're gonna do, like I said, sleep is on top. Oh, and I'm also using my favorite pen. This is the Muji N038. It is my favorite. I have so many extras of these that I just, I filter through and I think over the last, I don't know, six, six to eight months maybe, I think I've gone through about four maybe of these. I use them for everything. I love them oh so much. And then for my sleep, I go from 10 hours down to four. And then after I write in my hours and the days of the week, I'll use this Westcott ruler. This is my favorite ruler. If you're ever interested on like what I use for my planning, I do have a video I have several videos actually, I think on my channel by now, but I have a video that I just recently did of all of my Amazon favorites because the majority of everything that I use, I have bought or are available on Amazon because I am definitely one of those people that have a million Amazon boxes in my garage because that is literally the only place I will buy from. That or Target. Those are those, those are the stores that I kind of default all of my purchases too. So if you're ever interested of what I use for my planning, definitely check out that video and you can use all of the, all of my favorite items for a Hobonichi cousin or Hobonichi weeks planner. All right. So after sleep, then we do workout and then I swore I was going to get better with working out, but this week I only did two of my five workouts so far. Um, so we'll see. I don't know. I just haven't been able to get into that rhythm. Last year I was on it, but I got sick for like a month. I had a really bad cold and I just could not get over my cough. And so it was really hard for me to work out when I'm like coughing my head off. And so since then, I really haven't done any working out 
even though I want to. It's just I can't get that momentum back and that's like my hardest thing with working out and it's kind of the hardest thing for everybody is building that um like the what is it called like building the the schedule and kind of adhering to it and also the motivation I think I want to work out but I'm not 100% motivated and so when it gets down to me like my workout time I just I don't have that motivation and therefore I end up not working out it's just something I need to work on but let's see this week I'm gonna be on the third week and then I have the workout number and then I put the workout like what the body part is that I'm working out so oh my goodness this week is gonna be burpee I hate weeks Sunday is always cardio which I do not enjoy at all but especially days dedicated to burpees those are just the worst possible workout for me I absolutely cannot stand them all right and then this last piece is going to be the to do and that's typically my like the videos that I want to put out if there's like any kind of phone calls or kind of top level or high level things that I need to get done that's where I'll list them and I'm going to fill that out a little bit later because I don't really know I have an idea of what the videos are going to be next week but I don't have them off the top of my head, so we're gonna fill this out, or I'm gonna fill this out a little bit later. Okay, so now we're going to take this and I'm going to highlight in my work start times. I work 6 a.m. on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then on Thursday I start work at eight because I work on site and there's absolutely no way I'm going to be at, on site at 6 a.m. That just will not fly. And then Friday, I'm back at home and starting at six. So those are all of my work times. And now I'm going to put, pick out my, I'm gonna pull out my calendar and I'm just going to highlight in all of the other stuff that I have to do. And then I'll go back in and write in what that item or that task is later. So we have on Tuesday, something at four, Wednesday, at 4 30. This is also Valentine's Day. And then on the 15th, four o'clock, nothing on Saturday and nothing on Sunday. So, so we're going to go ahead and put this to the side because I no longer need it. And now I'm going to, again, turn everything sideways so I can write all of the stuff, the stuff into those sections. So we're going to do work up top. And then this is a um, I have a stamp from Hobonichi, and so it does a little bit of bleed through, but I'm probably going to end up putting a sticker, probably like a coffee sticker right here, um, just to cover up this bleed through. So that's where that is. It was because my husband's birthday was on Friday, and so I had a little stamp that I decided to use, but it bleeds through. And I, I remember it after I did it, but it's whatever. Gymnastics. Okay, so now that we have all of the appointments and things written in now I'm going to use my ruler and I'm going to time block because I use my planner functionally so I like to see you know how long I'm doing all these different appointments and meetings and things so that way I kind of time block that section so we're going to do that now so we're going to go ahead and mark all of my work start times and end times Oops. And I pretty much work until 3.30 every day, but then there are some days that I end up, um, after that 3.30 time frame, I have dedicated fitness time, so, but my main, like, working time, for the most part, is until 3.30 every day, with the exception of Friday, and that is my really short 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. time frame, which I absolutely love, and so that is my work. And now we're going to do all of the other little appointments. So that will take care of the time blocking. And now the other thing that I want to quickly do is I am going to put this washi down at the bottom of the page. So that way I have a little bit of decoration. And I'm just going to drag this all the way over because my to-do list I don't think is going to be so long that I need the full 
sidebar to complete. So we're going to do this and hopefully I'm able to lay, I am not the best person of laying down stickers or washi. It never really is like straight and even for me. All right. All right, I'm just gonna take my ruler just to kind of flatten because sometimes I get like little gaps in the washi from like when I'm laying it down, trying to lay it straight. So sometimes I get little gaps, but that's fine. Okay, so then I think that's pretty much it. So a lot of the, I have a lot of gaps down below. If you have not seen any of my videos, um, let me just do a really, really quick recap. So I, bought, I use my appointment or my planner functionally. So I like to see what I'm doing during the day, but after like between eight and nine o'clock at night, that's usually the start of my free time. Cause that's when everybody in my house pretty much goes their separate ways and goes to do like their nighttime routines and go to bed. And I usually will stay up until about midnight or one o'clock. And that's when I do the bulk of my reading because I am a big reader. If you would like to see reading content, I will definitely try to have the, um, my channel YouTube name, and I'll try to put a link to my channel if you would like to have reading content, but I will go ahead and annotate the, like my reading and what I read, what my ratings are and all that kind of stuff down at the bottom. So while it looks like there's a big gap of unused space down here, it will be end up using it, um, as the week goes on because that's where I write all of my reading. So with that, that is the end of this plan with me. Oh, let me one, I do want to do one thing. I am going to use my Tombow and just go ahead and write Valentine's Day up here. Um, even though I know it's going to be Valentine's Day, it's just something that I like to put down. It's like a little heart. Beautiful. There we go. Love it. Okay. So now with that, that is the end of this week's plan with me. So I want to thank everyone who has gotten this far and has made it to this point of the video. If you have made it to the part, this part of the video, go ahead and leave me some like heart or flower emojis to go ahead and celebrate this coming week for Valentine's day. And if you have not had a chance, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it. I do plan with me's monthly flip throughs, stationary favorites, all that kind of stuff. So if that would be something you would be interested in, definitely make sure you subscribe. I would so greatly appreciate it. And with that, I hope to see everybody in my next video. Bye.